This is what I do when I don't have time to get ready. Sunscreen. Check the rest on your hands. When you don't have time, a brush is your best friend. Take some foundation. Start swirling it out. This video is rushed because I want you to feel what I'm feeling right now. You can always go over this foundation with a beauty blender. Use a brush to apply it. It's way faster. And it also gives you a lot more coverage. Just take two minutes to blend this. Gently go over your eyes as well. Use a patting motion because that's way more gentle than using a swiping motion. And then taking a damn beauty blender and just going over what we applied on our face. Please bouncing it around. This is to minimize the appearance of any lines that the brush left. That everything is blended beautifully and smoothly and nobody can tell that you didn't have time to get ready. Using a blush. This is a cream blush. It's the easiest to apply when you don't have time with a brush. Quickly swirl it around. This won't move your foundation if you use a patting motion to blend this. You can again go over it with a beauty blender. I think I apply too much. Again, bounce, bounce, bounce. And blend it into your skin. Beautiful. I want to use a little of a nose too. Next is a highlighter. Sticks are faster, so we are going to use a stick. This one glides and gives you that beautiful glow. This is the Maybelline Master Strobing Stick. And then I'll take my beauty blender and blend it. You can also use your finger. This blends super fast and looks really beautiful. Next are the eyes and choose a color that you cannot go wrong with. So I'm choosing this. This is my favorite eyeshadow ever. I'm going to tip my brush, use a little and then just blend it all over my lid. This eyeshadow never fails me, so this is what I use for my quick get ready with me. It blends beautifully and looks so good. I'm also bringing it up to the crease to create some shadows quickly. Everything I do in this video, I do quickly. If you don't have time but you still want to do your brows, a pencil, a brow pencil is your best friend, but I don't have it, so I'm going to use an eyeshadow. The best way to do this is to do only this part of your brows, and they will automatically look so put together. <laughs> I put this in the wrong place. And then just brush them out with a spoolie brush. And this color that you applied will blend in the eyebrows. You can skip the eyelash curler, but my lashes are super straight, so I'm gonna do it. I'm not using my special mascara technique today because it takes so much time. Quickly putting on some mascara but cleaning the wand before doing it otherwise you will get late because you will get clumps and you will have to clean them so clean the mascara wand before opening it not before opening it while opening it and then apply it and then to minimize the appearance of clumps take a lash comb and comb it through while the mascara is still wet so that it takes out all the clumps right away. There is some construction going on in the background, so I apologize for the noise in the background. It's been going on forever. But the last step is lipstick. And if you are in a hurry and you did not get to do a lot on your face, which Although we did, we did put everything on our face. A darker lipstick is the best thing you can apply during these times when you have to get ready quickly because if you, even if you don't do anything to your face or eyes, good lipstick or a dark lipstick will make you look so put together. That is it, we are done. I'm gonna comb my hair through, trying to make them look more presentable. But for makeup, that's basically it. And then using some of my favorite perfume. This is the sweet perfume from Etude House. They don't make this anymore. And I am going to use it. And I hope you
you learned a lot from this video I'm actually getting late I was genuinely doing my makeup quickly because I was getting late my dad gave me five minutes to get ready I will see you soon in my next video take care of yourself and your loved ones don't forget to subscribe if you like my content and I'll see you soon